Vaccines train our bodies to recognize and fend off germs before they make us sick. Traditionally, vaccines are made using viruses that have been killed or weakened, like vaccines against the flu or measles. But growing viruses is labor-intensive and sometimes risky. Now scientists are using newer and faster technologies to create different types of vaccines against COVID-19. There's no chance people could get infected from the shots because they don't contain the virus itself. The target? A spiky protein that covers the new coronavirus. That protein lets the virus invade human cells. If the body's immune system recognizes the spike and blocks it, people won't get infected. One way is to copy a section of the virus's genetic code that instructs cells to make the spike protein. Stick that messenger RNA into a vaccine. The person's own cells will make the harmless protein. Then the immune system will spot the foreign proteins and make antibodies to attack them. Another method is called a DNA vaccine. Genetic code for the spike protein is put into what's called a plasmid, a circular piece of synthetic DNA and used as a vaccine. Both approaches prime the immune system to attack again if the real virus ever comes along. Whatever type of vaccine ultimately works, it likely will be 12 to 18 months before it's ready for widespread use.